how to know if you're in ketosis. In this video, we're gonna be going over a few signs in some other testing methods to let you know if you're actually in a state of ketosis or not. So one of the first signs that people notice is a different aroma of their breath. Their breath has a different flavor to it, and that's totally normal because when you're in a state of ketosis, ketones show up in three different ways. One is your breath, two is your blood, and three is your urine. And those are actually the testing methods that we'll talk about at the end of this video. But one of the first things that people notice is a different aroma in their breath. Some people call it keto breath, but that doesn't necessarily mean it's a bad thing. It just means ketones are present in your breath and you might notice a different aroma or flavor in your mouth. The second thing is if you're doing keto the right way, you should experience weight loss, especially in the beginning, because when you cut out carbohydrates, your body retains less water. So most likely, initially, in the beginning, you might notice some uh, water weight loss, which is fine, right? But you need to replenish that and drink a lot more water, and you need to supplement with um, electrolytes like sodium, potassium, magnesium. But that you, should, you still should be able to lose weight on the ketogenic diet if you're doing it the right way, eating high fat, moderate protein, low carb, which should help you feel satiated, which in turn should help you eat less calories, which will then in turn lead to weight loss. Some other signs, which are not good signs, but these are keto flu symptoms uh, that actually show you your body is transitioning into this new metabolic state known as ketosis. And for some people who have been living off glucose for the past 30, 40, 50 plus years, now all of a sudden are trying to shift over to ketosis, their bodies aren't adapted yet. And they might feel some keto flu symptoms like brain fog or lack of energy or uh, dizziness or lightheadedness or cramping of the muscles. And usually that's an imbalance of electrolytes, right? Well, like I talked about before, with not getting enough water or electrolytes, your body is going to experience some of these keto flu symptoms. But these are also signs telling you that your body is transitioning. But eventually you will feel better, which leads me to my next sign, which is mental clarity. One of the best parts about the ketogenic diet is how amazing your brain feels. The, the mental clarity and the improvement in cognitive function is like night and day. I like to compare it to uh, Bradley Cooper from the movie Limitless where he takes that clear pill and all of a sudden he becomes a genius. That's kind of what it feels like when you're in a deep state of ketosis. Your brain feels so sharp and energetic and focused uh, all day long um, and that's one of the, the main uh, benefits of keto and one of the signs you can tell if you're actually in ketosis. So now let's get into the testing methods. The most common one is the urine test strips that you can go to any store like CVS or Walgreens and buy some keto urine strips and you pee on the strip and if there's ketones present in your urine, it'll show up like a darker color and, um, and that's one uh, testing method to know if your body's producing ketones. Now, the thing with that though is these are ketones that your body is getting rid of through waste, through your urine. Um, those aren't ketones that your body is using as energy. And that leads us to our next one, which is uh, blood testing. Now, these are the ketones uh, that your body actually will use as energy. And this is the gold standard way of knowing if you're in ketosis or not, is to actually purchase a blood ketone monitor. I'm a big fan of uh, BioCoach. They have a great ketone monitor that is uh, probably the most accurate one out there. But there's a bunch of them out there. You prick your finger, you put a drop of blood into the strip, which is attached to the meter, and anything 0.5 millimoles or higher means you're in ketosis. So if you want to know for sure if you're in ketosis, just buy a blood keto monitor, prick your finger, and 0.5 or higher on that meter means you're in ketosis. The last way of testing is what's known as the breath test. You can buy a breath keto monitor that you breathe into, like a breathalyzer, and remember how I mentioned in the beginning you have a different aroma? Well, this picks up the ketones that are present in your breath and actually shows if you're in a state of ketosis or not. So those are the ways to uh, test if you're in ketosis, but like I mentioned earlier, there are some signs that you can be aware of that you will know if you're in ketosis or not. So hopefully this video was helpful for you if you're learning how to do keto the right way. Go check out my website, fittofattofit.com, or check out my book, Complete Keto, on Amazon, and uh, we'll see you guys in the next video.